hi all of you <coughs> today we are going to discuss how to create a recursive function in python we know that a function calling by itself is called a recursive function a called by itself is called recursive so with an example how we can do that here we are using factorial example so let me start with python python syntax so here i am getting value from the customers or the input value so you use input and uh, a number to find the factorial so wait, let me run this script and here getting enter number to find the factor so just we did input just getting the input from the customer so when you enter four you get that input let's see said let's see we are getting the data Yeah, entering four yes we are getting that four so here this is the simple steps in input is a syntax to get the data from the user so it will store in a variable n and ending that number that's all so next is we have to write a function to find the factorial so this should be a recursive function it should call itself so here i am going to define a function define i'm giving function name give py recursion okay just i'm printing so this is the function simply so here we should get parameter from the fourth function here parameter name is k just checking if k equal to one return one so if k equal to one it will return one otherwise return Okay, star this is the logic behind the function my question and here calling the same function with the parameter we are changing here so this is simple function so it's called by itself only parameter value we are changing it should be k minus one so let's see how it will work So next is we have to call that function. So I'm calling that function from here with parameter from the user. We got the parameter from user is n and we are calling that function. So we are giving result. Sending a variable for getting that result return value from the function because you function and we are printing that value
let's run this script so here invalid syntax here some syntax issue is that so i think you got that you should define function if case you have to give this syntax function request here so there also we have to give that so we, we here everything is fine now so we are running that script so it will ask to enter the number for i give but again we'll get an error because it's not a number so we give you are convert it into a number see the result is coming enter a number to find the factor for i given factor of 4 is 24 Again, I give five factor of four is five is one twenty. So these simple steps. Only here we have to check here when the this is syntax. You have, should remember the syntax. You have to add this colon. So define function function i inside the parameter. If particular condition satisfy, it will return one. Otherwise, it will call the function again then that will multiply with the, the old value so let's see how it will work so here this case first it will call value with 4 so 4 here 4 will come it will check if 4 equal to 1 no it's not satisfied so it will call 4 into my cursor of function of 3 so it will call 4 into Three, so it will come four star three. Again to call two. Again to call one. So when it's two, it is satisfy this thing condition and it will return one. So then total will return four into three into two into one. This is what how the function is working here this all things we can do it with single line because of this recursion is one of the greatest advantage of programming using recursion we can reduce a lot of big functions and i thought you will understand this Thank you.